Southwest Wind Power creates its most efficient turbine yet. AES's power storage facility ready for operation, and the Empire State Building becomes New York's largest commercial purchaser of renewable power. This is your Daily Energy Report. Hello, and welcome to your Daily Energy Report for Friday, January the 7th. I'm Ben Lack, your Chief Conversationalist here to bring you the latest daily energy news. Southwest Wind Power, one of the world's premier suppliers of distributed wind generators, is having quite the week. Just recently, one of the company's co-founders, Andy Cruz, was appointed to serve on a new Renewable Energy and Energy Efficiency Advisory Committee for the Department of Commerce. And yesterday, the company unveiled its most efficient turbine to date, the Skystream 600, at the 2011 International Consumer Electronics Show. The new turbine is capable of producing 74% more energy for commercial and residential use as compared to the older model. Their turbine is among the most efficient power grid-connected turbines available, providing an average of 7,400 kilowatt hours of clean energy annually per household. The turbine will also be publicly available in March of this year so that consumers can easily connect to wind power and use the internet to measure how much energy is generated through their machinery. AES Energy Storage has announced that the company's 8 megawatt battery based storage system project has reached commercial operation. The first of its kind in the United States, the initiative aims to deliver instant responses to grid operator requests for power in an effort to level the variability of generation and demand. The system is located in Johnson City, New York, and is capable of supplying 20 megawatts of reserve capacity upon full completion. The project uses AES's patented frequency regulation performance algorithm that provides optimal energy storage. The DOE awarded AES a $17.1 million loan guarantee for phase two of the project. And finally, the Empire State Building in New York has become the largest commercial purchaser of renewable power in the state. The building will purchase 55 million kilowatt hours worth of renewable energy credits, or RECs, every year from Green Mountain Energy's parent company, NRG Energy. The purchase will cover the building's yearly power consumption. A large-scale purchase such as the one that the 2.85 million square foot building is pursuing is a movement that is popular among business and institutions seeking to improve their green businesses. Have thoughts or comments about today's show? Then please visit us at dailyenergyreport.com and let us know what you think. That's all the time that we have for today. Thanks for watching and make sure you tune in next week to check out the latest Daily Energy Report. Until then, have a great weekend.